so today it's uh, pretty cool. We're out in the Mill Creek watershed and we're checking up on the hydrology apprentices. This summer we hired four of them and they have three different types of surveys that they're doing this summer. So the students, I think, are really, you know, on the ground kind of um, leading the way. I think of them sort of as the prow of the ship, um, kind of forging the way and helping, um, you know, real life scientists figure things out. You know, different summers we've offered different apprenticeships. Um, so we've had wildlife apprenticeships, um, hydrology apprenticeships, uh, watershed restoration apprenticeships, forestry apprenticeships, botany apprenticeships. Um, they're really diverse. You know, there's restoration going on. There are restoration projects that are about to happen. People are gonna come back and measure this again. And so they're contributing to this long-term vision of restoring this forest. And I think that's a huge part of what makes this kind of job rewarding. Kind of just solidifies in myself like I'm doing good work. I'm putting myself into a position where I'm going to bring a future to other people that maybe I won't meet in my life but I will be able to influence their way of life, their culture, their like experience in the natural world and just make them happy as well. Bueno, la primera cosa que podemos aprender de un árbol sequoia costera es cómo... Yeah, we share um, wildlife and, and plant life facts and, and little trivia and, and also talk about the, the historical and cultural significance of this place. We want to be inclusive and we want to welcome everyone here. Everyone belongs in the parks. The fact that I get to be a part of an organization that's able to protect these redwoods for future generations. It's like, that's the kind of organization I want to be in.